Benson follows some blockers and Trey Benson one of the toughest guys to tackle one of the best in the country Kurt, at yards after contact a year ago Travis scans and rolls and puts it short that's Benson out of the backfield who was spun down at the 33 after a big fella we're at number 18 and that means a lot at LSU Benson knocked down for an impact a lot of the time Second down run, Benson tries to pick his way. There wasn't much there. Gets obsessed. Interior running game so far. Benson gets about a yard. Benson stutter steps and plows forward. He and third consecutive run and Benson to the left kind of runs downhill you know you're thinking oh no as a coach when a receiver is running around with the ball in his hands Those... once again it's Bell as a block Benson again runs through tackles that's what he does the first guy there rarely gets him down you, to average more than four per carry after contact is big absolutely did you see that time they they brought the blitz there with greg brooks but a good job of picking it up and set from the pistol with that blocker on the right side benson this time has to escape and will fight back and again the two back set that's been so effective getting the ground game going here in the second half and picking his way through his Benson and just powering for a 12-yard gain into LSU territory. We, we talked at halftime. When we came out. We said, what could get Jordan Travis going? And we said, like any yep. quarterback, we said the running game. And it's exactly what Mike Norvell and his offensive staff have committed to. Travis has made the explosive plays. He and the receivers getting a lot of recognition. Keel Coleman's had